The 6915 phone is a desk phone that allows for quick call handling. Before your first time using your phone, your system administrator must configure some key features. Let's take a closer look at your 6915 phones. Your 6915 phone comes with a corded handset. Next to the handset is a software screen. This is not a touch screen. Along the side and across the bottom are physical keys that correspond with the words shown on the software screen. Many of the tasks you perform with your phone are completed using these keys. The software screen has a toolbar that has status icons for a variety of things including your network connection status, voicemail indicators, missed call indicators, and your extension number. In the middle of the screen are the keys available on your phone. The keys can be your primary phone lines, provide extra lines to place and receive calls, and perform common operations like speed dials. The navigation wheel is used when there are a list of options and pop-up screens on your software screen. Click the navigation wheel to see an additional page of keys. A total of six keys per page for a total of 12 keys can be programmed across multiple pages of buttons. The soft keys at the bottom of the screen change based on what you are doing with your phone. When your phone is idle, the hot desk and redial keys are available. Redial calls the number shown on the screen. Hot desking allows you to assign yourself to the phone with your extension. Please see our additional video for how to use the hot desk feature. Below the software screen are the hard keys, located on either side of the dial pad. On the left side, the keys are Contacts, which provides access to your corporate, personal, and if integrated, your mobile phone contacts. Call history, which shows all the calls received, placed, and missed. Voicemail, which allows you access to your voicemail box. You can listen to your voicemails using a recorded prompted voicemail system. Settings, which allows you to configure your phone to work best for you. Under settings are options like connectivity, audio settings, display settings, and language. And volume control, which allows you to adjust the volume of your ringer and your active audio path, like the handset. On the right side, the keys are End call, which allows you to disconnect from any call, regardless of headset, speakerphone, or handset. Redial provides access to previously dialed numbers. To quickly redial the last number dialed, double press the redial key. Hold, places a call on hold. Mute, which mutes your audio. And the speaker and headset toggle button. This button allows you to swap between your speakerphone and headset. On the back of the phone, you have six ports. The power port. The power port is needed when power over your network cable is not available. Network port. This provides internet connection for your phone. Computer port, which is used to allow network signal to pass through the phone when network ports are limited in an office. Headset port, which is for connecting wired headsets. Handset port, which allows for the connection of a wired handset. And a USB port. 